My name is Key Sato. I'm Top Stories photo editor. And I create photos for the top, AP's global top stories every day. We have a photographers like in all over the world, but like, you know, we also have to rely on handout photos from the government like, you know, when we don't have access to, like, you know, we're not there. Normally, like, you know, the, each photo editors um, zoom in and blow up the photos and like, you know, we have to inspect the photos from corner to corner to make sure you know, it's not altered or you know, manipulated in any ways. So here's an example from a North Korean news agency. The North Korean leaders watching the, uh, the military exercise out of the window. And it uh, looks like there was a map uh, what the exercise was going on. So the outside is clear, and even uh, the cigarettes and drinks in focus. But the map itself is all blurred out. So we decided not to use this image. Even the context or content of like, an image hasn't changed. Like, you know, with like, you know, just like a little bit of like, you know, the photoshopping, you know, the, our policy is like, you know, we do not manipulate or alter in any ways. I mean, you know, we really have a strict policy that, like, you know, whatever you see from the AP photos, like, you know, everything has to be accurate. Yeah, this, this, this was like several years ago, like, you know, a Latin American photo editor found out that, you know, the handout from the, the Cuban government of Fidel Castro and his picture, you can see on his ear, it appears to be he had a hearing aid on. Then later, it looks like a hearing aid was like digitally removed. So we decided not to touch those photos. Just like you know, the text reporter like, you know, don't make up any quotes, or cannot add or you know, subtract like, anything from the photos. We want people to come to AP to see the truth. 